What's going on YouTube? Kamikaze Von Doom here with another Division 2 video. So sit back, relax, grab that popcorn. Don't forget to hit that like. Subscribe if you haven't already. And let me know what you think in the comment section below. But in today's Division 2 video, I'm going to show you all hidden hotel locations that have secret loot. So if you are new or returning to the game, chances are you probably don't even know what I'm talking about. But there are six different loot locations throughout the open world map, and it unlocks a final location uh, at one of the control points. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, please sit back. Uh, you can uh, pause the video whenever I do the coordinates, so, but I will walk you through each of the locations, okay? Now, what I would probably stress right here at the beginning of the video is you need to open up one control point and I would probably uh, recommend you do this on the global difficulty challenging or heroic just so that you can get better caliber gear whenever you hit these loot locations because remember these boxes are going to be in the open world all of these locations open world so they will scale up to your global difficulty setting now again if you don't know how to do that go to your map toggle over to difficulty uh, global difficulty setting and then you can change this I would probably do either challenging or heroic now for this video I'm just going to run through it to show you each of the locations so I will be doing this on normal but the reason why I was saying is you do need to unlock the Washington Monument control point this is the only control point that you must unlock to do this hidden hotel you know easter egg thing because once you go to all six locations it will unlock a secret room that is in the bottom of this control point and the only way to toggle that is to actually have this unlocked now to make your life easier you could also uh, do metro ruins and flooded livy now uh, Ellipse Fuel Depot would be uh, an, another nice one to do. So these four control points would uh, be your best bet. That way you can just fast travel to each of the locations because the six locations are in this general vicinity. All right. Now for the people that might have already uh, have completed this, I'll show you exactly what it would look like. Okay. Now this is my original character. I know I have already done all of these locations previously, so I'll show you what it looks like if you have. And then I'm going to jump to my secondary character, and then I'm going to show you all six locations and what it looks like at the end. So we are at the bottom of the Washington Monument control point, and then you can see I have six white lights. Two, three, four, five, and six. Now if you have completed this, you will have six white lights. If you have not completed this, these lights will either be red or they will not be on at all. So the only way to see these six white lights is to have completed the entire hidden hotel location, you know, Easter egg hunt. Now also you would notice that the door down there is unlocked. That will only unlock if you complete this. Okay. So I'm going to jump to my second character. We're going to do all of these hidden hotel locations together, and then I'll show you the end. So don't forget, hit that thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Let's uh, let's go ahead and do some Easter egg hunting. And booyah! So now I am on my second character with the uh, lovely hunk outfit and nemesis mask. But we are back here at the Washington Monument control point. And then going back up here, you remember looking at those lights. Well, they look a lot different now on my second character. So you can see there are no white lights on at all. There are two red lights. Um, we're going to go through each of the locations for the hidden hotels. And we're going to see um, you know, how this changes over time. And then once it is all complete, you will see that door back there open up. And then we will see you know, what's behind, what messages, things like that. But without further ado, let's go ahead and find the six hidden hotel locations. Location number one, and this is a very common for everyone who has played the game. This is where you first start off in the, in the entire game. 
So when you first land in Washington, D.C. to help take back the White House, this is going to be the area you spawn into. Now, my coordinates, 1354 by 2707. Now, uh, looking at this, I'll show you exactly where you spawn, and uh, it might look familiar. So if we come over here, so you would typically spawn right here, right? And then you would start your mission all the way to the game. Now, if you come over here, you will see some containers, and then you will see this little balloon, okay? Now jump over, and then it is actually inside of this bottom container. Now this is your first hidden hotel, and it is called Vosburg. So this is the Vosburg Hotel. Once you get in here, click the check in sign and then get your secret loot. And then you can see some uh, some cool things around here. We've got uh, some little trinkets and little Easter eggs around. Pretty wicked. Now again, this is the Vosburg Hidden Hotel. And let's go to our next location. Location number two. Here are your coordinates. 10, 16, by 3487. Now the easiest way to get here is to fast travel to the Metro Ruins if you have it already unlocked. If not, it's easy, you know, just take it over really quick. Now once you spawn here, what you're gonna do, er, wrong way, you're gonna exit out the spawn area, take a right, you're gonna go down this escalator, and then where that red light is, is where the hidden hotel is over here at the metro station. So here we go, and boom, here is your hidden hotel. Now this one is called the Rockin' Pete Hidden Speed Hotel. And it says, uh, don't touch my bike. All right, fair enough. So then pick up your loot, and then again, make sure you check in. So make sure you hit the check in button. It will be blinking afterwards. All right, that is location number two. Location number three. Here are your coordinates. 12, 17 by 17, <laughs> 17. Now the easiest way to get here would be to fast travel to the Lincoln Memorial and then just run straight up. You can see the trail that I ran to get here. And then we are just next to this underground entrance, okay? Now, when you're here, you will see these boxes next to a wall. Well, this wall actually has a hidden hotel in it. And you can see a little parrot right here. All right, here we go. So jump over here. And booyah, here is the Z Barbecue Joint Hidden Hotel. Now, remember, check in as soon as you get here. Boom. And then pick up all of your loot. Now again, I am on normal just so I can run through this, but I would highly recommend just put this on heroic and you'll get the best loot possible. All right, there we go. And that is the Z barbecue joint. And that was location number three. And location number four, here are your coordinates. 1121 by 1526. Now we are still in the West Potomac Park now the last one was over here next to that underground entrance, so then you're just gonna run across the street over here to the tree house, okay? Now another easy way is fast travel to the Lincoln Memorial and then you can see the trail that I run to get here, all right? Now this is gonna be location number four. Now this is what it's gonna look like when you run up to it, okay? It's just gonna look like a little tree house, a little crate in a tree and then pick up all of your free loot. And then this one is called Mista Treehouse. So this is the Mista Treehouse Hidden Hotel. And it says, take a Trenimbus, <laughs> tr tremendous nap. And then uh, from the Hiddens. Now pick up your loot and then make awesome. sure to okay, check goodbye. in. All right, now that was location number four. Location number five. All right, so this is number five. We are back in the White House part of the map. 
the easiest way to get here was from the DCD headquarters. My exact coordinates for location number 5, 1471 by 2858. And then you can see right here the line I took. All I did was I fast traveled from DCD and then I ran all the way over here. Now this one's pretty cool <clears throat> because there's actually a lot of loot right here. Um, just in this one area, there's there's quite a bit of loot. There's loot all up in this tent. There's loot back here in that tent. And there's loot above us. But we're looking for the hidden hotel. So you can see right here in this uh, in this wall, they put up some uh, some ivory, you know, some ivy, some uh, some vines to try to get people not to see it. But in fact, this is the McMilly Camp Hidden Hotel. And it says, The is on the table. No loot in the crate. And then it shows uh, it shows them at the uh, Washington Memorial. Interesting. Or, uh, yeah. And then uh, remember, hit the button, check in, like always, and then pick up your free loot. And then this one's pretty cool. Has like, uh, you know, some cool presents. Oh, that's a cool little toy right there. We have a little Christmas tree. And then of course, your bed. But uh, like I was saying, there is loot just above here. There's there's quite a bit just all around this area. I mean, just this room right here, there are two loot crates. And then of course, you can uh, farm all of the, uh, the other areas right here. But that was location number five. Let's go to uh, location number six. And finally, location number six, our final hidden hotel. Now here are your coordinates for location number six. 1167 by 2651. Now, if you have the flooded levee um, already taken over, then you can just jump right over there. But for me, I went to the Washington Monument, and then you can see the route I took to run over here. <clears throat> now, for this one, again, you can see the, uh, the hidden hotel balloon up top, and then this is going to be another one of those hidden crate type of deals. So you jump over the crate, and then it'll be on the other side. Now, this is the Poopy Town Hidden Hotel. Enjoy uh, the fluffies and then all the fluff, fluff uh, plush animals, right? Stuffed animals. We have some uh, snakes here, you know, not too bad. A little cheetah. What is that, a hippo? Okay, okay, some flowers. And then remember, check in. And there you go. So that is all six locations. So uh, let's jump back and see what we have. All right, so you just fast travel back to Washington Monument. Here I am. And then you're gonna come back down here to where those lights were that I showed you. Now remember there were two red lights. Oh, now you can see it's all lit up right up there. So there's so, there should be six in total. So let's see here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay, so all six are red. And then there is a button right here behind me. So you see this button, press it. All right, oop, and then you just saw that door open up. And now all of the lights are white. And we can go back down and read the rest of the hidden hotel message and collect your loot. So it says, or actually, let's, uh, let's try to photo mode this ish. There we go. All right, so it says Bobby. If you read this, great, we're so happy you're alive. We knew you'd find your way back to our hidden hotels. We had to run, baby. The city has gone bad. Why didn't you stay with us? We're leaving this hellhole city. Please catch up with us. Uh, what, what does this say? Left you something nice for the travel? We are in need to talk. Love, hidden so i guess bobby hidden was their son and then they uh the whole family went around and did all of those different hidden hotels and left clues to come back here now prior to uh these last few updates you used to get a weapon crate here however now it's just a material bag and this material bag will reset and then you can just come down here and hit it over and over but you come down here and you know 
There's a little uh, spot here with the plush, but that's about it. That is all of your hidden uh, hotel locations and your final little Easter egg prize at the end. Now, I hope you enjoyed this. If you found this helpful or informative in any way, shape, or form, please hit that thumbs up. I am Kamikaze Von Doom. Don't forget to hit that like and, you know, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone. Peace. Now, don't forget, hit the thumbs up, support the channel by subscribing, but then get access to these emotes and more. Come over to Twitch at Kamikaze Von Doom. I'm probably live streaming right now. Some so, yeah, you can uh, ask me some questions, come hang out, and, uh, you know, lurk and work, as we say. But all right, everyone, I'll see you in the next one. I am Kamikaze Von Doom, and, uh, yeah, let's go over to Twitch. Peace.